Hello folks, it is a beautiful summer day here at Bugs in a Jar Farm here in the middle of the summer of 2024 where I think I need to update my uh, video on the Hummingbird Tiny House because we have made a very exciting addition long overdue in the Hummingbird Tiny House we have put on a finally we have put on a screened porch which uh, took us three years <laughs> but it has completely revolutionized the hummingbird tiny house so you now have a way to get out of the rain and the bugs uh, at bugs in a jar farm the bugs you don't want to mingle with here at Hummingbird. So this is now your front porch and uh, your little kingdom out here. So that picnic table and fire ring, this area out here goes with Hummingbird. So uh, the Hummingbird tiny house, as I say, has gotten a makeover. We have this absolutely beautiful new red cedar door to uh, welcome you in and so this porch is six by eight feet out front so here is hummingbird tiny house and when we say uh, we call hummingbird a tiny house it is truly a tiny house it the inside dimensions of hummingbird are seven feet by seven feet it's hard to even make a video so you need to understand that hummingbird comes with one twin bed one twin size bed the mattress measures 38 inches wide uh, hummingbird is is really designed for single travelers however if uh, you are a couple wanting to rent hummingbird do understand it, there is one twin bed measuring 38 inches wide we have an absolute maximum of two guests in hummingbird unfortunately we cannot uh, accept dogs dogs are very welcome in our other two tiny houses blue dragon or seahorse and sorry no dogs maximum of two people in hummingbird uh, since it is summertime uh, you do need to understand there is no air conditioning in hummingbird or any of our houses you shouldn't need it we've had a little bit of a heat wave this year uh, but on the flip side, Hummingbird is the only ha only tiny house that is heated. And that little heater makes this little house uh, nice and cozy. It's very well insulated and how small it is. So you do have heat. Uh, you do have a fan. And uh, it's just wired into the house. So, you know, you're on full electricity here at hummingbird there's um, and obviously the wi-fi and the internet you're you, you know you're right down by the main house so you have excellent uh wi-fi and internet and you have this beautiful little back deck let's just go take a look at the little back deck so you now have you know the screened in covered front porch uh, but in addition to that we'll talk about the kitchen and the bathroom in the minute so in addition you have this beautiful little very private back deck we call this our sunrise deck it faces due east uh, so this is a great place to come have your coffee in the morning. It looks out over the creek and the garden. And you have pretty much 100% privacy 
back here on this little deck and I uh, encourage you to enjoy your morning coffee uh, here on that deck but speaking of your morning coffee just uh, I have uh, a video on the uh, community kitchen and bathroom but you are steps away from the full community kitchen which you are welcome to so your coffee maker and all that are a 10 second walk and here is the bathroom the shared community bathroom is a few steps away uh, so all three do understand both the kitchen more importantly the bathroom is a shared community bathroom so if you have any problem with sharing a bathroom with other folks hummingbird might not be the best fit for you uh, blue dragon and seahorse both have private outhouses and where it also have access to the full bathroom but anyway we are very thrilled to announce all of these updates and we hope you can come see us at hummingbird if you think you need something bigger the hummingbird is not appropriate for children if you have kids and dogs uh, I, you need to be thinking about Blue Dragon or Seahorse Tiny House and you can find those videos elsewhere on this channel. If uh, you're interested in booking Hummingbird or any of our tiny houses just go directly through Airbnb and how you find bugs in a jar you click on tiny houses you do a search of tiny houses and you put in Wilseyville w-i-l-l-s-e-y-v-i-l-l-e -E. do a tiny ha house search in Wilseyville New York and all three of our tiny houses will come up if you have any other questions you can inquire about Hummingbird or uh, Blue Dragon or Seahorse. Uh, you can reach me with inquiries directly through Airbnb and find out pricing and availability and all of that. So we hope to see you this summer uh, either in Hummingbird or one of our other tiny houses available here at Bugs in a Jar. Hope to see you soon. Goodbye.